As New Mexico hospitals fill up, medical leaders are pleading with people to stay home for Thanksgiving. News 13's Francesca Washington is live at Presbyterian Hospital to explain the strain hospitals are facing. Hospital officials say they're seeing an unprecedented number of patients and they want people to buckle down this holiday to help control it. Find your humanity for the next few weeks. Bring this under control. It's a very difficult time with the holidays approaching, wanting to be with family. But if you think in the long run that those things you do now and, and the get togethers you may forego this year because of the pandemic, will help to ensure that those family members, and those friends are there in the next year. Hospital leaders say they're nearing the point of crisis standard of care, meaning they will have to max out all hospital space to care for COVID patients. Doctors say the best way to create capacity is to avoid gatherings this holiday. They warn if behaviors don't change, in three to four weeks, they'll be out of ICU beds. Presbyterian officials did give some positive news. They say in the past week they saw a downward trend in positivity rates. It's likely a very early sign that we're starting to see the benefit a week into those public health orders. And if we continue on that trend, we will see that rate of positivity coming down, which will mean there's a slowing of the spread of the infection in our community. As of this morning, Presbyterian has 256 COVID-19 patients and 47 ICU patients. So far, they haven't had to transfer any patients to the Gibson facility. Back to you. All right, thank you, Francesca. UNMH tells us they are also reconfiguring units to deal with the influx of COVID-19 patients.